Skyrim is home to over 90 unique weapons, and some of them are kind of hidden or a little bit secret, or maybe I'm just bad at looking for them. Today, I'm going to show you three of these 90 weapons that you probably missed in Skyrim. Spoiler alert, the last one is very hard to get and it almost made me rage. It took me over an hour and I still had to cheat. Let's see if you're better than I am. All right, so the very first secret weapon that we're going to get is going to be located up here in Solitude haven't been to solitude before you can stop right here at the headsman because that's the person we're going to need to talk to or you can go into castle dower yala's home or the winking skeever so i'm going to try yala's home first or jala however you say it and that is going to be located right over here i don't want to do too much cuttings can keep track of where i'm at okay here we go yala's home and it's locked go on perfect You're not supposed to be angry. And of course, he's angry. You wouldn't be a cell sword, would you? There we go. I Good stuff. Problem. What's the problem you have? May have I'll do it. Kill the leader of the Broken Ore Grotto. No way. Oh, no. Come get some. You know, that dragon never did come get some. Some say he still doesn't have some. Be sure to stick around for the last weapon as well, because I think 99% of Skyrim players have never gotten that weapon. All right, and here we are. Here we are at the Broken Ore Grotto, or at least we're close. Wonder why it's called Broken Ore Grotto. Hmm. Alrighty, and this should be pretty simple and straightforward. Um, excuse me, sir. Sir, sir, sorry. Oh, wow. That's actually really cool. Huh. So far been a very straightforward area. Oh, okay. Captain Hargar, and he's already dead. Man, these boss fights are awesome. These boss fights are lit. And that's all she wrote. For Broken or Gato. Now we just have to find a way out of here. Alright, and all we have to do is come back to our main man, the Hensman. You stay out of trouble. Broken or Gato is free of bandits. Here's your pay. He pays us a hefty sum, and now we should be able to say, follow me, well, I need your help. Now, once we do that, we can go in here, ask him if we need, or you need to tell him to trade something with us. You can see here, not only can we take some keys, but we can, in fact, take the Headsman's Axe. And I believe this is the only way you can get the Headsman's Axe in all of Skyrim. So, ladies and gentlemen, let's move on to weapon number two. I actually recognize that I had it on that character, so we're going to have to use a different character to get this weapon, but it should be the same. Easy mode. <laughs> Bruh. And if we come right here, we'll see a unique note, Bolar's Writ and Bolar's Oathblade. A very cool backstory to this one. A belayed person who was hunted down by the Thalmor left this blade for us here. Not the craziest enchantment, but still very, very cool. Keep that there's some of the enchantment gone. I wonder how many Thalmor he killed. Let's move on to weapon number three. For this weapon, we're going to come down here to Falkreath. Did you see a dog out there? No comment. Did you see a dog out there? No comment. We're going to go directly south of Falkreath. Roughly like right here. I think that's already showing up on the map. It's that little cabin icon right there now if you love skyrim and you want to join a community of awesome skyrim lovers be sure to join the discord which is link is in the description okay so i think i finally got here it's up here on this cliff literally right there and ladies and gentlemen let's see how we can get a unique weapon from this <laughs> hello anybody home hey calm down i'm not here to hurt you sorry why live out here all by yourself sorry about Don't your family who killed your family i'm gonna take care of them ready. what are those targets for those are you any good with your bow no not really ready Excellent. for some practice all right angie what can you teach me oh wow that leveled me up wow this levels you up a level every time i'm ready for some more practice I'm ready for some more practice, my man. Johnny kind of bad. This one's low-key pretty tough. 
how am I not hitting this target, man? Bruh, no way. So I am getting lower than I need to be. Wow. Yes, I have to practice more. Turn around, Angie. We have to practice some more. Oh, gosh. This is going to suck. Dude, what? It was this moment that I realized this is going to be a crazy hard challenge. I tried this thing over 20 times and could not get it done. So I resorted to something else. Whoa, Angie's bow got added. How in the world did that happen? Ladies and gentlemen, this is Angie's bow. There's absolutely nothing unique about it. It looks the exact same as a regular hunting bow. You wouldn't even know the difference. Unless, yeah, it's the same bow. That was definitely worth cheating for. If you missed these three weapons, I'm sure you missed these four bosses as well. Ladies and gentlemen, be sure to watch this video. Don't forget to read your Bibles and don't forget to pray. The most important thing you could do is to come to know Jesus Christ as your personal Lord and Savior. Thank you all so much for watching. And above all else, have a blessed day. Thank you for your time and peace out.